Brian Sensei here. Are you the type of person that often visits websites with foreign languages on them? In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Microsoft Edge to instantly translate any website. Let's check it out. Okay, so here I am in the Microsoft Edge browser and I'll be taking a trip to Japan next month. And so I was searching the internet for a place that I can go to and enjoy hot springs and some nice Kobe beef and other wonderful foods in Japan. So I searched and came across this website, which is a Japanese site. So you'll see here that it's all written in Japanese. It looks amazing, but when I come down here and I try to read things, it's difficult for me to make out. So you'll notice here at the top right of the browser, there's actually a little pop-up that says translate page from Japanese, translate to, and here I can choose from a variety of languages to translate it to. In my case, I'm going to keep it on English and I'm going to go ahead and click on translate. And boom shakalaka. Look at that. It's all now translated for me. I can see here now that this allows me to select nights that I'd like to stay and I can search for available rooms in Arima Onsen. And scrolling down, I can find other information. Here's events that are happening. Down here, we have some things that users have shared from their trips. Awesome. So another thing to call out up here is I can click back up here. You'll see these characters here. It says translated when I mouse over it. But if I click here, this gives me those translation options again. And I have some things here like, for example, I can check this box to say always translate pages from Japanese into English and click done. Also, I can click show original to go back to the original site's language. Also, I can click in here and you'll see here that before I clicked translate originally, there's also some options here, which is never translate Japanese if I always want them to stay in the original language, or I have the option of never translate this site. All right, and that is how you use the translate tool in Microsoft Edge. If you want to see more of these videos, consider subscribing to my channel and click the notification button so you can be notified every time I post new videos. If you have a specific tech tip you'd like me to create, please let me know by completing the form in the description below. And I'll see you on the next one.